So uh, Michael Fowler bought the property Marty in uh, 2005. We wanted somewhere to capture the Macedon Ranges that we love. So we went on a five year journey of planning, building, natural stone, copper. Uh, we wanted to blend into the mountainscape uh, and we also wanted it to be homely and, and have you know, functioning for children, parents retreat, entertaining. And I think we've achieved that quite well. So the architect um, was Peter Woolard, and when he came up here and saw the, the natural bush setting, uh, the vista, particularly the view over the valley, because most properties in Mount Macedon face south, we wanted to look at the mountain and capture all of that. I think when they walk up here, they look out and they say, oh my God, have a look at the view. Um, the entry with the stonework, the stonework took 16 months to do. Um, took up a whole quarry. Um, so it's quite unique because if you look at it from an aerial point of view, it's actually a cross. And the Anzacs celebrate the top of Mount Macedon with you know, the, the cross at the top of the mountain. So the architect came up with the idea that we'll call this the cruciform house. So if you look at some of the uh, magazines and books it's been featured in, it's referred to as the uh, cruciform. So when you come through the driveway, you go around the lake, you come through the natural setting of the bush and then the house just appears as you come out of the bush. Extremely private, it's well set from the road. It's in a quiet cul-de-sac of Macedon, but elevated, so you literally hear nothing. Um, Macedon Ranges to me is country living, but you have the best of schools, the restaurants, 45 minutes of CBD bringing up children in a country environment, but having the city, everything about the city so close, and particularly the schooling up here, and it's just a great place to live. What will seal the deal is as soon as you drive up the driveway and you see the house as it appears, you're done, you're sealed.